Lesson 4. Solving quadratic equation using the quadratic formula. Bueno, baka familiar ka na sa quadratic formula. That is, the negative b plus or minus square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a. Pero, saan nga ba galing si quadratic formula? Since formula yan, yan so dapat may origin siya. Saan nga ba siya nagbula? Bueno, bago natin gamitin itong formula, dapat alamin mo natin kung saan nga ba yung pinagalingan niya. So, nanggaling yan sa ating standard form. ax squared plus bx plus c is equal to 0. So, isulat natin dito. ax squared plus bx plus c is equal to 0. Gamit ang ating standard form at ang completing the square, makukuha natin si quadratic formula. So, gamitin natin yung process ng completing the square. Isolate natin si constant term. In this case, si C. So, meron tayong ax squared plus bx is equal to negative C. Meron tayong numerical coefficient dito na A. So, i-divide muna natin yung buong equation ng A. So, i-divide natin dito ng A. Ganun din yung right side. Now, we have A divided by A, that is X squared na lang, plus B divided by A, B over A. Then, we have the variable X is equal to negative C over A. O, bakit meron tayong mga letters dyan? Kasi hindi natin alam yung exact value nila. So, ginagamit natin yung mga numerical coefficient. Now, gawin na natin siyang PST. The perfect square trinomial. So, we have x squared plus b over ax plus blank is equal to negative c over a plus blank. Ano ngayon ilalagay natin sa blank? So, gamitin natin yung shortcut. The middle term b over a divided by 2 o magiging multiply na lang natin sa 1 half then square natin b times 1 that's b over a times 2 to a then square natin now meron tayo lalagyan natin dyan ay b square all over 2 square 4 then a square a squared. So, ilalagay natin sa ating blank i. Inisin natin yung blank kasi fraction. B squared all over 4A squared. So, dito din. B squared all over 4A squared. Ayan. Next. Gawin natin siyang square of a binomial. So, we have x Copy the sign of the middle term plus square root of b square, b over square root of 4 to a raised to 2 is equal to simplify natin. LC din natin. Ang denominator is a chaka 4a squared. So ang LC din natin ay 4a squared. Yeah. Then 4a squared divided by a, 4a, times the numerator, negative c, so negative 4ac. Then we have, copy b squared. Kasi parehas na sila ng denominator. Now, extract the square root. Get the square root. Yan. Then, Oh, wala na yan. Squared natin. May iwan na lang si x plus b over 2a is equal to ang numerator natin ac is not the perfect square number. Then binomial siya. So may iwan sila. Positive, negative, square root of negative 4ac plus b squared. All over Itong denominator, perfect square numbers. 
So, pwede natin siyang ilabas sa ating parentheses. So, square root of 4, 2, tsaka a na lang. So, yan. Then, continue natin dito. So, mangyayari, ilipat natin si b over 2a. Transpose natin, may iwan na lang si x. Is equal to negative b all over 2a. Nilipat natin siya, lagyan na natin sa unahan. Then, positive, negative, square root of negative 4ac plus b square. Meron tayong denominator over 2a. Yan. Then, since similar fraction sila, pwede natin i-combine. So, x is equal to negative b plus minus square root of negative 4ac plus b square all over denominator natin 2a. Equal na ba sila? Ayan. So, in this case, nauna lang si b square. Pero pwede natin interchange dito. So, x is equal to negative b, positive negative b square root of b square, siya yun, minus 4ac all over 2a. And this is now our quadratic formula. So, ayan si, complete, uh, si origin of quadratic formula. So, dapat master mo talaga yung ating completing the square tsaka si extracting the square roots. So, ayan ang origin ng ating quadratic formula. Proceed tayo ngayon sa solving gamit ang ating formula.